In this video, we'll be seeing how to push your projects to GitHub. First of all, you have to log into your GitHub account and we have to create a new repository. You can come to this repositories and click on new here. Now you can give a name for your repository. You can simply give the name of your repository here and you can set this as public or private. We'll be keeping it as public right now. You can add a readme if you want. Click on this and it will be added. Now you can click on create repository. Okay. Now you have to install Git to your system. For that, you can simply search for Git and uh, you can select the first result and open this URL. And here we can see this download option here. Simply click on download and you can download the Git for your system. So we'll be downloading it for Windows now. Click on this download and you can click on click here to download and it will start downloading. Wait for this to complete. Now after downloading, you can simply click on this file and it will start the installation. Here we can click on next. Now you can change the path to which you want to install Git. We'll be keeping it and click on next here. Keep on clicking next until you see the button install. You don't have to change anything. Simply click on next. Now you can click on install here. Now wait for this to complete. Now the installation is complete. You can uncheck this option and click on finish now. Now we'll be using this Laravel project to show you a demo of how to push your project to GitHub. So for that, you can open this inside a terminal. You have to come to this project directory inside the terminal. Using VS Code, you can simply go to this terminal option, open the terminal and uh, here we can simply type git and uh, you can do that process here. Instead of this, I'll be using the CMD. So for that, you can open this project inside the explorer. Now you can see that I have opened my project directory inside the file explorer. So it is inside desktop. You can see my first Laravel app and you can simply open command prompt from here. For that, you can simply click on this address bar and here you can simply type CMD and hit enter. Now this will open command prompt in that specific directory. Hope you can see that here. Now I'll zoom it a little bit so you can view it properly. Now you have to simply make sure that you are inside the proper directory. This is my project directory. You have to be inside this exact directory and you have to open it inside the terminal like this. And now we can type git in it and hit enter. Now we can simply type git add space dot. Now this will add all the files and folders. Now we can run this command git commit hyphen m and then give the message. Hyphen m means message and you can pass the message. That is initial commit since we are committing it for the first time. And now we can hit enter. Now you can see that it is asking you to run these commands and specify the email and the name. So let's copy this command from here and you can paste that here. Now change the email to which you prefer to use. Now simply change the email and hit enter. Now just like that, you have to copy the second command as well. That is this one to set the name. Copy and paste that here. Now change the name. Now we can run the previous command that is git commit once more and hit enter. Now you can see these items are added and it will be uploaded when we use the push command. Before that, we have to specify the origin. For that, open your GitHub repository that you just created and click on this code and you'll get this HTTPS. Simply copy this URL from here. Click on this copy. Now open the terminal back and you can type the command git remote add origin and then you can give the URL. Simply give this command like this and you can simply hit enter. Now we have to use the push command. You can use the command git push hyphen u origin and give the branch name. Now hit enter here. Now this will upload the details to your GitHub page. Now this command will open this kind of a login if you haven't logged in. So if you have logged in once, it will not ask you again. So now you can click on the sign in with your browser. Click on this button. And you can see this kind of a URL opens and it will be automatically logged in since we are already logged into our GitHub page here. So now if you come back to the terminal, you can see that the project has been uploaded to the GitHub page. You can see that here. Okay. So now you can go back to the repository and refresh the page. Simply refresh this page and you can see that we have created a new branch. So let's click on that branch. Right now it is main, which is the default branch. We are using a different branch that is master. You can click on that. And now you can see our project has been uploaded to 
the GitHub repository. Now we can set this main as the default branch or that go to the settings and here you can see default branch option. Simply click on the switch icon and you can see this kind of a UI. Simply click on this main here and you can select the master branch and click on update and click on understand. I understand update the default branch. Now this will update the default branch and let's go back to the repository and uh, you can see now this is the default branch. Now if you want to delete this main branch you can simply come here and click on view all branches and here you can delete the main branch according to your wish. Okay simply click on this delete and that will be deleted. After refreshing this page you can see in the branch section you are only having the master branch and it is the default one also. So hope you understand how to push your project to GitHub. If you have any doubt you can leave a comment below and I will be responding to them. If you like this video give it a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel for more such videos.